Hey guys, it's Chris here, and I'm gonna talk to you a little bit about one of our best-selling nets. It's pretty simple. You put your whole small bale in it. So, in order to put it on the easiest, what I do is take my bale, flip it up on end. You're gonna take your net and open it all the way. I kind of do this like a pillowcase, is what I would say, if you're gonna put it on. And you just put it all the way to the end, put it around. flip it up and then at this point you can do two things right now because we never suggest using um, any hay that has twine or baling uh, wrap or anything like that you always need to remove that but if you're gonna be carrying it you can either cut your twine or you can leave it on and cut it off when you get to where you're going so in this case because of how I'm gonna show you guys how to carry it I'm going to cut the twine off One of the easy ways to try and uh, carry this bale to where you're going, say you're going to a show and you don't want to use your mini net and your horse has no shoes and you can hang it in a stall. What I do is I just tie it over here and then you can just throw it over your shoulder. I've walked this bale out here to this bee feeder. Um, we have some exciting news coming about bee feeders, but in case you already have a small square bale and a bee, uh, bee feeder, they do work really well together. All right, so what you're gonna do, is just throw it up in there. And then what you can do is you can just tie it to the side here. Um, they are long enough that if you want, you can stretch out the net and get it to attach over here also. So with the nets and the bee feeders, perfect.